Hey guys, I'm back once again for another Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom toy review. And next time we're going to be taking a look at the Triceratops from the Roarvoids collection. And as always, before we get to the awesome figure, we're going to review its package first. So as usual, you got the traditional Jurassic World cracked up logo with the gate-like structure, the volcanic eruption backdrop, the sign of the T-Rex's head with the soundbite indicating that this is a Roarvoir and the uh, sticker on the side with the action feature which it could do this on the side Triceratops Owen in blue get the Jurassic World logo on the well each side and then flip it on the back we got the picture of the Triceratops which strangely enough has a darker color of the uh, like the dark shade of brown much different than the one we get sort of like uh, they show in other figures and again, we got the Jurassic World logo cracked open. Triceratops in different languages. Jurassic World fax app. And then the other Roar Voice you can collect. And of course, we did get the Baryonyx, but that will be for the other review on uh, my little brother's channel, which this Baryonyx is owned by him. So now let's take a look at this girl. First stop, head sculpt. Honestly, still amazing. Like every figure, again, from Mattel. Just so well detailed and so accurate. Like, also what I really love about this is the detailing on the horns. He's got these cracks on it just like in the movie, the Jurassic Park 1, I would say, since this one is from Isla Nublar. And the detailing everywhere about it, it's just phenomenal. Also like the paint job as well, even though there's a little bit of, it's a little bit of a shame that it doesn't have a, a cream underside like uh, some of the uh, the Jurassic Park figures does because it has like a cream a cream side right here paint like airbrushed in on the legs but yet again like that doesn't really bug me too much and then we got detail like detailing all around the tail is right there it's also a detachable part so uh you gotta put it together if you take it out the package from the other side like just gonna turn it this is gonna keep turning and looking at it it just looks like it's, it's such an amazing figure the detailing on it is amazing paint job is really good as well like, there's nothing else bad about this figure I could even find. There's nothing really wrong with it. Like, really, nothing. I love this Triceratops, and this was obviously something. And this is actually the first, like, new, like, herbivore or large herbivore I've ever bought from the Jurassic Park toy line or anything. And this is one of the reasons why I wanted to collect this thing, because it'll be my first herbivore I've ever bought from any Jurassic Park toy line, other than, like, that tiny little hatchling from 2009 or 2013. Like, literally. This is absolutely phenomenal, and I'm really glad to have it. And the action feature will go over it. If you press this part of the uh, the back here, the head moves open, and it makes, I guess, four different sounds, but they're all mixed together. Those are stomping and roaring. That's the Tyrannosaurus Rex roar into the Triceratops, which is kind of strange because it's just like Hasbro's Triceratops from uh, Jurassic Park 3, but other hand, let's get to another action feature. Growling and roaring. Same one, but without the growl. So that was the four different sound effects. Now it's going to go back to the same uh, different, it's going to go back to the same uh, looping action features and everything. And you cannot deny that the fact that this is really playable and you can reenact that sick triceratops scene so well with these toys. Now I don't have to go through size comparison which I already did in the Extreme Shopping Rex review as you know. But yet again this is so so good in my eyes. Oh one more thing before we end all the review. We have the Jurassic World Jurassic Park logo on this side right here. And the Jurassic Park facts scan thing. Yeah we already know. Alright, so that was today's look at the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom Triceratops Roarvoid figure. Hope you guys enjoyed this figure review, because I pretty much did, <laughs> like, enjoyed making them, because these are such great figures. So, that's it for this review, and see you guys later.